Well, speaking of moms, someone's mom's visiting our class today. Gabriella, would you like to introduce our guest? Okay. Introducing a scientist who studies cool things in the ocean. Let's hear it for my mom, the marine biologist, Dr. Cordoba. Yay! Yay. Thank you. Gracias. Hi, everyone. I'm so happy to join you today. We were just oh. talking about how to take care of a pet. And since you're a marine biologist, I bet you know a lot about taking care of animals. I sure do. You know, a pet is a living thing, and so are all of you. So what kinds of things do you all need to stay healthy? Oh, um, well, I like to eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Oh, oh, and a snack. <laughs> maybe, maybe two snacks. <laughs> yeah. Pets need food, too. Yes, and water. And a home. Very good. Anything else? Uh, Here's a hint. <sighs> oh, oh, animals need to breathe. Muy bien. Very good. Well, Susie, I think they're ready for their surprise. Oh, yes. A surprise. Come on. Your surprise is waiting for you in the... Super Family. getting a glass pet. Hmm? What, something's in it. <gasps> oh, oh, look. Wow. wow. A praying mantis. Yeah. Oh, wait, what's a praying mantis? Well, a praying mantis is an insect that lives in nature on plants and leaves. And it's your class pet. A gift from me to you. Oh, oh thank you. you. De nada. You're welcome. And you can observe your praying mantis and study him, just like real scientists. What does he eat and drink? Praying mantises drink water, just like us. Oh. So the water goes in here? You got it. And you know what they like to eat? What? what? Crickets. Yeah. Crickets, cool. <laughs> it is cool, May. Hey, hey, should we put some stuff in here um, so he can play? Great idea. Maybe you can find some leaves and twigs so he can hide, climb, and get some exercise. Mama, we forgot something. Remember, you said animals need to breathe? They sure do. This screen goes on top and lets in lots of air. Boy, taking care of pets is hard. There's so many things to remember. Don't worry. We're going to make a classroom pet chart. That way we'll know whose turn it is to take care of our pet. Yeah. yeah. Okay, scientists, let's make a nice home for our new class pet. Yay! Yeah. Hey, you're a scientist. You can yeah. try this, too. <laughs> okay, scientists, we're going to make a home for a new class pet, a hermit crab. Hermit crabs like to dig and hide, so add some shredded coconut and soft soil. You can also use gravel and soft sand. Hermit crabs like to climb, so put in a big piece of bark and a log. Spray the terrarium every day to keep it moist and humid. And remember to add water into a bowl. Then put in some apples for food. You can observe your hermit crabs every day so you can discover how they move and how they eat and how high they can climb. You can explore all the ways hermit crabs behave, just like a real scientist studying animals in the wild. When a hermit crab grows, it needs to move into a bigger shell, so make sure you have extra shells on the terrarium. And since they like to climb, remember to cover the top. Now it's time to make a chart. Remember, someone needs to feed him. Someone else can give him water. And just like us, hermit crabs need to exercise, so make sure they have things to climb on. Remember to keep their home humid by spraying water. And don't forget to always have extra shells. Great job, scientists. How do you like your new home? I like it. <laughs> 
beautiful. <laughs> I think he does like it, May. And your new pet chart is a great way to remember everything he needs. Oh, yeah. yeah. Hey, look, um, my job today was to fill up his water bowl. I found leaves and sticks for him to exercise on. My, my job was to put on his metal screen so he could get lots of air. And I got to feed him a cricket. <laughs> and I'll make sure we have a supply of crickets to feed him every day. But wait, we're only in school during the week. Who uh, will take care of him on Saturday and Sunday? Oh, don't worry. I'll bring him home with me. And I promise to take good care of him. Yay! Okay, okay. Okay. You know, there is one more very important thing your pet is missing. What? what? A name! Oh, yeah. Okay, I have to head back to work, but I had a great time today. Oh, thank you for coming. Thank, thank you. you. Bye, Mr. Yeah. Enjoy your new pet.